Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to show you how you can cut the time it takes to generate an image using Invoke AI 3.0 with Stable Diffusion SDXL 1.0 on an M1 MacBook Pro by half. I'd say that's a pretty awesome improvement. Now this is in comparison to the video I did about two weeks ago where I showed you how to install Stable Diffusion and just basically get up and running. I got some good feedback from you guys. One of the things that you guys complained about was the speed at which it runs. It's pretty slow. So that's part of the trade-off, I guess, when it comes to using Stable Diffusion on a Mac. The M1 MacBook Pros are a couple of years old. You can't really use Stable Diffusion on a Mac that doesn't have a GPU. You can, I believe, but you're going to have to set it to use the CPU, which makes it even slower. It's already slow enough on a Mac with a GPU. Having said that, I think it's still worth using it and having it on a Mac. I use it to generate images all the time and I'm quite happy with it. 